Spooky, scary skeletons and shivers down your spine. All right, show me the first stages, Henry. Let's go. Okay. Oh, you're just right there. Okay, I'll come over and you can see it. Oh my gosh. Which one do you do, Fran? Oh! So good. I like the purple. Okay, take me in. Let's go see the spooky pumpkins. I'm here to see them. Okay, there's the pink one. Franny. Franny. And then who did the spooky gray one? That's spooky. This one kind of looks like Charlie Brown. Like a shirt. I love it. And there's that beautiful purple. That's awesome. I love it with the teal. Bless you. That's yours? Oh, I like it. And then Henry. It's cute. Henry kind of looks like a Mickey Mouse face. Spooky one, I like it. I like this one too. This kind of looks like a bat in the back. You guys did awesome. Oh boy, now I'm late again. Oh boy. Okay, bye guys. Welcome back to KNYT News. Today is Friday, October 27th. I'm Kriana Banks. And I'm Sydney Johnson. And now on to your student news. Please see one of these people to purchase your wristband. On this side, they read Blackout for Easter sales. And on the other, they read Don't Be Afraid of the Dark, It's Only the Nighttime. Wristbands are being sold for $2 each and all money raised will be donated to Easter sales. Thank you for your support in this great cause. The soccer's program 12th annual storm, the Castle 5K, is on Saturday, November 11th at 9 a.m. The registration fee is $25 up until October 25th, which is also the last day to guarantee you a shirt. Go to runsignup.com and search Storm the Castle or fill out the registration form to sign up. The Mental Health Awareness Club is hosting a bake sale on Halloween Day here at the Castle. During our lunches, we will sell an assortment of desserts for $1 to $2 per item. Come out to the terrazzo during our all lunches on Halloween day to get some goodies from Meha. These have been your daily announcements for Friday, October 27th. I'm Kriana Banks. And I'm Sydney Johnson. Have a fantastic Friday's Rich Foods. And now on to your weekend report, Arby, Bryce, and Lee, take it away. Welcome back to Weekend Report, guys. I'm Bryce Hopkins. Let's get to the haps around the castle. All right, to start Friday, we got picture retakes. Transportation and media at Richwoods Auditorium at 9 a.m. Halloween night at 6 p.m. All right, for today's segment, the question is, who is your favorite Halloween movie killer? All right, are you ready? Yeah. Who are you here with? TV. All right, so who's your favorite horror movie killer? Michael Myers. Who are you here with? John. What's your favorite horror movie killer? Um, Michael Myers. All right, who I'm here with? The GOAT, man. Who's your favorite horror killer? Michael Myers. You e marry our king. All right, so who's your favorite horror movie killer? Horror movie killer? I might say Michael Myers in that one. All right, who I'm here with? Jayla. Who's your favorite horror killer? Lee. Who are you here with? Uh, Mr. Hogan. Who's your favorite horror movie killer? Definitely Jigsaw. Same here. Ethan Carter. Say Nick. All right. Who y'all favorite horror movie killer? Freddy Krueger. Uh, Michael Myers. All right. Who you here with? Josh. What's your favorite horror movie killer? Ghostface. He has a Chucky hoodie on, but hey. Kobe Jones. All right, so Kobe. Who's your favorite horror movie killer? Uh, I'm gonna have to go with Chucky. Chucky. All right. Who you here with? Darren Marquis. All right. So who's your favorite horror movie killer? Oh, snap. I don't watch horror movies. You don't? But I'll, you know, I'm going to go with uh, Freddy Cooper. Those are some good killers. My personal pick is uh, Jigsaw. Um, Freddy Cooper. I'm going to say Jason. 
That's all for today's Weekend Report. I'm Barbara Wilming. I'm Bryce Hopkins. I'm Lizzie Lee. Have a fantastic Friday, Rich Woods. Yeah.